Morning. I swear a lot. Ladies and gentlemen, welcome to Armored Core. So, I'm jumping on a new AAA release. It doesn't happen very often. I don't think Baldur's Gate 3 counts, although I guess it is a sort of a similar vein, so you could say it does. But yeah, I don't do this very often, but I gotta be honest. I've been quite excited for Armored Core. I know it's, like, I've been a big follower of the Souls games for years, but of course, just because Armored Core is by From Software doesn't mean it's a Souls game or in any way similar to a Souls game. That's not really why I was excited for it, but I have to admit, knowing that From Software would, are the ones doing it was pretty cool. I'm pretty sure it's always been a From Software franchise, but I digress. I saw multiple years ago gameplay footage of For Answer, I think it was called, Armored Core, don't remember which number, For Answer. And I thought it looked really cool. And I've always wanted to play Armor Core, but I've never gotten around to it and I've never really had the opportunity. But that changes today, provided my computer can handle playing this and recording it at the same time. We'll see. But I'm quite excited. Big fan of mechs. I love me some mechs. Kind of all about mechs, among other things. So I guess I'm really not all about it, am I? But the point is, I'm quite excited. Enter a pilot name. Well, you know what? It's gonna be. It's gonna be me. <laughs> what a marvelous. So I've heard mech customization in Armored Core is pretty fucking good. And that, I have to admit, I'm really excited for. But also, the gameplay looks exceptional in Armored Core games. I have no idea if this one's good or not. I haven't really followed it. I just looked forward to it, and now it's here. But I have high hopes from what I know of the series, the franchise. And now I'm playing this one. Wake the dog up. Handler Walter verified. Activating cerebral coral control device. Augmented human C4621 has awakened. Time to get to work, 621. Powering down your entry capsule on my signal. Now, activate the AC. For those of you who don't know, ACs are armored cores. Those are mechs. ACs are mechs. I saw it. I saw it. You can't tell me. I didn't see it. I seen it. It was there. So this game actually requires the use of a controller. So I haven't done a controller game for a while. But my old PS4 controller still works. Uh huh. Do I? I'm so glad to hear that. Truly, I am. That was definitely my biggest concern. Use it to close the gap. A catapult? In this day and age? Main system. Activating combat mode. I thought for a minute this was first person and I was going to freak out. Okay, yeah, so we're in there. We're piloting the mech. Wait, I can play this on keyboard? Because I went to the controls menu and it was very adamant that the only thing you use is a fucking controller. Let me try that, actually. Oh, I might want to play this on mouse and keyboard, actually. I think I prefer that. Yeah, fuck it. Two seconds. <clears throat> In terms of setup, it's a lot less faff for me as well to just use a mouse and keyboard. But those of you who are veterans of the series, let me know if this is actually the way you should play. Because some games just support one control type over the other. Boost movement. Boost mode! Oh, there is some mobility here. Oh, boy. I mean, I know this from what gameplay footage I've seen, but I've never had it hands-on, you know? And you have a limited amount of boost. Oh, 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 the sl Oh, fuck. <laughs> it feels good. It feels good. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh, oh. I know that's a stupid thing to get excited about, but I like clean movement, especially when it comes to things as big and janky as mechs. When they've taken the time to consider 
good movement. Proper solid movement. Even though it looks incredibly silly right now, but that's just because I'm shit. Some actions consume energy and are disabled while Ian is depleted. Ian re re replenishes rapidly when grounded. That would be our boost. You can back... Oh yeah, you can Dark Souls it if you want to dash around the place. It's more like Bloodborne, really, but still. This isn't a Souls game. Don't pretend that it is, because it's not. Oh, melee. Oh, melee. Hang on. Wait, let's just... Ooh! Oh, I'm going to make biscuits with this. Or die. I'll probably die. The reticule automatically targets on-screen enemies. While there are multiple enemies, the enemy closest to the center of the screen will be prioritized. Move the camera to change priority target. Okay. Clear out those guard mechs. Perfect chance to test your AC. Yes! 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 I'm going to get him! I got him! He's dead! He's fucking dead, Jim! This feels very good, by the way. Just... This is slick. This is smooth. This is nice. Missiles? Ah, he's fucking dead. Oh, okay. Yeah, this... I'm... Mm, 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 I'm feeling myself. Yeah, boy. <laughs> you put it into overdrive and then hit him with the melee source. Yes, I did. I do believe. <laughs> The missile launcher equipped to the right shoulder of this AC is capable of multi-lock, which allows you to attack multiple enemies simultaneously by holding down the input for that button, for that weapon even. Just hold E and you can target multiple people. Good, good, good. Lovely. Oh, it feels nice. It's going to take a while to get used to, definitely. Like, uh, a lot of my combat at the moment is going to consist of me flailing around, probably mashing, like, shift all the time. Use repair kits to repair your AC. Ah, cool. Repair kits can be used up to three times per mission and cannot be used in rapid succession. But how much do those heal? And it tells you. Like, hey, buddy, you might want to be careful. See the contaminated city down there. Whoops. That's where you're landing. No, there's no city over. Oh, that city. Access ah. the catapult. Catapult. I want. I can't wait to pick my own mech. This mech's cool and all. He's decent. He's solid. But I want mine that I can love and hug and call George, and I can paint it pretty colors and give it guns that I like. Where is the shotgun? I need a shotgun. Time to fly. Six, two, one. We're gonna fly. Oh, we're off. And it becomes Space Harrier, or it's a cutscene. get our hands on Rubicon's coral, we'll make a killing. Plenty for a merc with a fried brain like you to buy their life back. I love buying my life back. And I love being a merc. I like being a merc and then being a nice guy. Enough chat, back to work. Because I very much have the choice to Stand not be a nice guy. I'm having to scavenge a license. You'll need ID to operate. I don't think that's how licenses work. I can't just go into the street and scavenge a driver's license so I can drive a car. I suppose that could technically work. Don't do that, but I, I guess technically. Excuse me, guys. Have any of you seen a license? Oh my god. <laughs> They're shooting at me. Walter, what do I do? I'm gonna get you, 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 I got you, idiot. Remember kids, save ammo. Oh hello, I didn't actually see you there at all. Very good, very good. Ah, oh, it, ah, oh, but movement does feel good though actually. Use assault boost to move rapidly in the direction that the camera is facing or to rapidly approach targets. Control. Then you can cancel it. Picking up signals from AC Rex. There's no full damage, is there? No. The Not when we were jetted from orbit. No, I don't think there is full damage. I still need a mercenary license. Guys, can I come in? Thanks. Uh, I need a license. To whom would I speak to about a license? Oh my god. Oh my god. Oh my god. Oh, assault boost is the coolest thing ever. Ah, ha, ha, ha. Ooh, you're fucking dead. License. Come on, you gotta give it to me. I'm such a good pilot. 
Guys, please, just one license. I don't want to queue. I don't want to queue for it. I know I'm British. It doesn't mean I like queuing. Off you go. I have a fucking blade. I live in the same country as London. I can use a blade. Have you got anything? Okay. License code. Thomas Kirk. License code extracted from an AC wreck in the contaminated sea. Contains the pilot's registration data. RB18. Call sign Thomas Kirk. Rank 26 slash E. Affiliation independent license expired. This one's already expired. Yeah. Keep looking. Ugh. I thought they were going to do a cool thing where it's like you pick which of the three licenses you want to use and that would determine what mech you get. Which would have been a neat idea, although I probably wouldn't have made a lot of sense. Oh god, I can melee all day and I might. Although I know it's on the left side of my um, crosshairs, it does require charge and cooldown and such. But you know, I'll make it work. What? Fuck you, sir! Yeah. Yeah. Take that. Keep a low profile. Oh. Don't want them breathing down our necks. Oh, I may have fired at it multiple times. I I did shoot at it. I um does that count as a low profile? Best part the best whoops. Best way to stealth is to kill things and then they don't know you're there, right? It works. License code extracted, AC rec contaminated city, G7 Hakra. RB29, rank 22D, affiliation Balam Industries, license expires in 12 hours. Corp license, easily traced. Forget it. Yeah, fuck the corpse. We're going independent. Oh, hello. Ow. So I'm scared of when we fight an actual proper AC, because that is going to be pure chaos. I've never... I don't think I've ever done anything like that in a game before. So, I think it'll go poorly. Oh, get wrecked, you fucking helicopters. That's not even a heli- Is it a helicopter? I don't know. It's dead, whatever it is. It looked like a helicopter. It's not anymore. Oh, I love assault boost. Oh, oh it's good. Oh, it's good. I could do this for a while, and I think I will. How about you all fuck off? Yeah, how about that? Yeah, how about that? I did. What more do you want? I ran out of boost for a while there. Could you excuse me and fuck off at that time and order now? Do I actually run? Yeah, I do run out of ammo. I just looked in the bottom right. I have limited ammo. That's concerning. It just means more melee. I miss. Off he goes. Oh, I don't know. I forgot how long melee takes to charge. Okay, I should be more careful in the future. I shouldn't be taking this kind of damage. Really shouldn't be taking this kind of damage. Oh, boy. It's fine. It's fine. Monkey Gordo. Registration number RB37 Monkey Gordo. Rank unknown. Affiliation independent. License expires in 15 days. That seems it's good. Valid, but the pilot's rank is no good. We can't use this. I fucking... I'd, up one more rank I don't mind working my way up. Transmitting marker. Go and check it out. Why am I stealing a license in the first place? Why can't I just fucking fill in a form and, and send it in? Why, why do we have to immediately do crimes? Why not get the license, then commit crimes? That does appear to have killed him. It didn't actually kill him. Ooh, that was close. Ooh, ooh, buddy boy. Giving me some spooks there, sir. Ah, uh, this, that was way too far away. I don't know why I thought that would work. It's fine, it's fine, it's fine, it's fine. While standing on a vertical catapult, perform a jump to quickly reach higher place. I forgot I could jump. I don't think I've been pressing space at altitude. all. Or I have and haven't been thinking about it. I've mainly been using dash. Because it's kind of neat. I don't know if you've noticed, but it is. Goodbye! 
I'm coming for your licenses. I need a work visa. I live here now. Try accessing the rack. Ooh, what do you got? I actually want to look at the mech. It's pretty cool. It looks actually very similar to mine. That might be intentional. Checkpoint reached. Registration number RB23. Rank fits the bill. Good. Call sign. What? What? Looks like they were on to you. Oh, 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 why? What? Ow. Oh. I've noticed. I. I'm doing my fucking best, man. A From Software really gonna hit me with the supposed to lose battle in their not Souls game. I've used all my repair kits. You know what would be even more terrifying? If this is not a supposed to lose battle. I'm coming for you. Oh, that was. <laughs> this is not the smartest thing I've done. Ooh, ooh. Needs to get moving. Oh my god. I didn't notice until the last second that, like, missiles were happening. Uh, no. I'm aware. Oh boy. I mean, I suspect I'm supposed to- I mean, I suspect I'm supposed to lose. I don't know, was I? Am I actually supposed to win that? I've just started playing. You fuck it, really? Okay, alright. Wow, they ain't pissing around, are they? Okay, alright. I gotta get good. Oh, shoulda known. Shouldn't. I mean, it's a From Software game. It's not a Souls game, but uh, that did really mean that it wasn't going to be easy, didn't it? That's it. Try accessing the wreck. Well, here's what I'm going to do. Right, I'm going to access the wreck, and I'm going to fucking run. Wait for it. Wait for it. Wait for it. Run! Run! Run away! Run away! <laughs> RB23. All right. I well, you're not the one down here, are you? Take it out now. They won't have enough to ID you. Okay, it's a helicopter. Which means. Use your mobility in the air to get clear of explosions on the ground. Okay, so uh, the melee is actually a good option because it does a fuck ton of damage. I did end, I did exit the combat area for a moment there. Okay, all right, we're fine. We're fine. We're fine. We're fine. We're fine. I did ignore what you said about um uh you know, staying off the ground when there are missiles, but I also don't know when he's firing missiles. So that's a little awkward. He's firing missiles now. Come on, shoot, 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 shoot. And go in. I did fuck that up in a major way. Um, I did extremely fuck that up. It's okay. I've got a repair kit. Oh no, oh no, oh no. I'm fine, I'm fine. It did give me my repair kits back, which I appreciate. Uh, 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 he, he's gone. We've, we've missed him. We've entirely missed. Sir, we've missed. Uh. No repair All right, it's just me and him now. Okay, fine. I can do this. I'm coming for you. I missed entirely. This is very extremely humiliating. The most humiliating. He left the combat arena. Fucking coward. Coward. Shameful display. 
Oh my god. Oh my god. Ow. No, more missiles are coming. That completely ruined me. No. Okay, I can win that. It's just, you know, tricky. And um, if you if your fucking AC limit gets hit, then you're fucked. And uh, yeah, oh boy. First boss, yeah. I was so certain it was a supposed to lose fight until the game said try again. That was awkward. What? I didn't mean to do that. I don't know if that was clear. I missed again. It's so humiliating. Now's the time. Go. I'm thinking if I can apply some pressure, I can get that bar. Yeah, that yellow bar that's now orange, I can get it to, to red and maybe max it out and that'll do something to him. I don't know. Doing my best. There it is. Oh, God damn it. He's more mobile than I am somehow. That doesn't seem right to me. He's somehow a lot faster. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I'm familiar. I'm aware of my failures. I can't believe I missed. No, I fucked it up entirely. Just shoot him, just shoot him, just shoot him while we have the chance. It's going a lot better this time. I can still lose, though. I can still lose. I, I just, just watch me. I could, I could so lose right now. Like, you have no idea how much I could lose. Oh my god. Oh my god. Oh my god. I know AC is at 50%. No, don't lock me up now. Where are you even? Oh my god. He's so fast. There we go. You fucking bastard. <laughs> oh. That was a lot more stressful than the first boss needed to be. Confirmed. Heavy combat helicopter is down. Yeah, it sure is. That's all for our work here today, six. I would fucking hope so. Here's the call sign from that license you picked up. Thanks. What is it? Raven. That's a good call. That's a really good call sign. License code extracted. Uh, RB23. Raven rank dash slash F. Affiliation independent. License expires in three days. Raven. So what am I going to do when it runs out? That's, your new name here on That's a really good call sign. Raven is an exceptionally good name. What am I going to do when it runs out? Do we just go steal another one or do we fill out a form and send it in? So yeah, a thing about this game, this series even, I knew this was a thing in Armored in uh, 4 Answer as well, is that, you know, you have your standard pay for being a mission, you you typically play as a mercenary, we got 170 grand for this, but expenses include repair costs and ammunition costs. If you use too much ammo and take too much damage, you make less money. So be careful, and uh, presumably if you fuck up parts of the mission, you also lose money. So it, you could very realistically get to a point where you actually lost money on a mission, I imagine. And that would be a huge downer for me. Coral, a sublime substance. Discovered on Rubicon, a planet on the frontier of developed space. For a time, Coral was a revolutionary energy resource and data conduit, poised to transform human society by leaps and bounds. They called it the Fires of Ibis, a storm of flame that tore through the stars, leaving lethal contamination in its wake. Coral, the kindling, was thought to have been utterly consumed, forever lost. However, 
On Rubicon, the embers continued to burn. Some software games really the like their burning analogies, don't they? Return. To stoke the fire. Fire, flame, kindling, to light the flame, burning. Yeah, yeah, we get it, we get it, we get it. You should hire a new writer, perhaps. I'm only being facetious. Of course. All mind. RB23. Call sign Raven. Authentication complete. Very cool, very cool. MIA status. Restoring access privileges. Yeah, this used to be someone else. We're not missing an action anymore. The mercenary support system. Good. Welcome back, Raven. Thanks. I've been, it's, it's always been me. It's always been me. I guess. Raven. That's who you are now. You're on Rubicon. Yes, Raven. That guy I from Tekken. Work for you already. Take a look, six, two, Hang on. I want to do some customizing. I want to. I want to fiddle with my mech. This notification follows restoral of access privileges. Uh huh. All Mind provides a combat training simulator to support its mercenaries. Oh, I should look at that probably. Your license was in a suspended state. Perhaps you may need a refresher. Maybe. As an added incentive, completion of the exercises will be rewarded with AC parts. Ooh. You stand to benefit regardless. It's true. I should do them. It's not very cash money for an LP though, is it? Let's have a look at the AC. Customize AC assemblies using the parts you have available at the assembly menu. When assembling an AC, ensure your build keeps within the maximum weight and EN load parameters. Okay. So... Apparently, we're well below the parameters, so I guess we're fine, but I imagine, I don't know for sure, that the higher your weight, the slower you are. Oh, we have an I. Head part for scout ACs. Originally spec. Okay. That's my head. That's my missile launcher. That's my pulse blade, which is very cool. And this is my rifle. Always nice when they have mechs who help actually have weapons built for them, not in them. Like, you literally have to pick up an assault rifle and use it. It's always nutty, but it's great. Now, of course, I don't have any parts because I haven't, you know, gotten any. But we appear to be a scout AC. We're a fairly light one. This makes sense to me. No expansions, because, I don't know. I don't know what that is. Paint! Paint! Make AC cosmetic adjustments from the paint menu. This includes coloring and textured settings. Oh no. Oh no. Oh. Oh, I could be here a while. Oh, and you do each individual. This is a fantastic customization. Oh my god. Oh, this is pretty good, actually. I'm not going to do this now. Because we'll be here for too long. I will do this. I don't know if I'll necessarily do it off camera. Linky suggested a brilliant idea of like making a separate not part of the series video where I just chat while um, customizing the mech. And I think I'll do that. I think I'll do that instead. Because, you know, we've got stuff to do. We've already got like a million training things to go through as well. Oh, we can have decals as well. Can I... Can, can I upload decals, perchance? Like, there are presets, sure. Like, oh, cool, you can have your, uh, your sponsorships and stuff, cool. Can I- oh, if it let me upload images. Oh, if only it let me upload images. That would've been so hype. Uh, uh, stop. Foreman, stop. Look into this later. Image editor. I've, I'm still doing it, I can't help it. Okay, yeah, so I can't necessarily upload images, but there's plenty here to work with. Oh, I'm gonna spend a while doing this. Okay, all right, all right, but let's get away from that for a moment, shall we? Save and load AC assemblies. Oh, cool, so loadouts. Nice, okay. Let's move away from that for a moment because there's so much there. There is so much there. All right, well, I'll mostly edit through these. Like, I'll edit it all out. I'll go through it, edit out whatever I've done. If there's anything interesting that happens or cool or whatever, I'll cut back in. But otherwise, for you guys, we'll skip through this. I'll go through it, you can skip through, and then we'll go to the next mission. We'll do it that way. Or at least try out the new stuff we inevitably get from doing these. To land shots of moving enemies, you must pull the trigger while they're within lock-on range where target tracking is active. That's a thing.
This is also a different gun to what I used before. Machine gun, I dare say. Good start. Oh, that was all of it. Oh, okay. It was literally just one practice thing. I see. Okay, well, we can keep going then, can't we? Uh, I've got a machine gun now. That's great. Missions. So we could destroy artillery installations or clean up on grid 135. Mop up Dafeng MT squads deployed in grid 135. 68,000 rewarded. It's less money, but it seems easier. If it's less cost, it's probably easier. I don't know. We just ease ourselves in a little bit. Got a job for you, 621. It's an open call from the Archibus Group, one of the extraplanetary corporate forces. To all independent mercenaries, this request comes from Schneider of the Archibus Group. Schneider! The operation will take place in grid 135, Southern Bellius. Uh huh. Your objective is to destroy an MT squad sent by Dafeng, a Balaam company, and a competitor. What's an MT? Grid 135 is a key foothold in Archivist's efforts to conduct a coral survey in the contaminated city. You, the independent mercenaries, are the key to maintaining our lead in the coral survey race. I don't care if you're maintaining the a lead or not. Looks forward to news of your success. I look forward to your money. Briefing over, and happy hunting. Money! Give now, please. Buy new mechs. Big mechas. Stronger mechas. Okay, well, if it's just... I don't know what MTs are, but they're probably not that special. Now I need a rep. Get their attention, By shooting these very minor targets. Yeah, I got it. Would it be going along the lines of the story if I just carved out a niche for myself as a very small-time but effective mech pilot? Like, never taking on the really big and dangerous contracts, just being reliable and getting stuff done and making a steady pay, and then meeting a nice girl and settling down and getting a bunch of dogs. That sounds nice. That's the kind of pilot I want to be. Should be simple enough, unless it isn't. Watch it not be simple at all. I need to test out my new gun as well. Probably should have actually gone into, like, the practice area to try out my new gun, but whatever. We'll see what happens. I have no idea where you are. Oh, there you are. Well, it won't make any difference to you, because you'll die anyway. Oh no, oh, bad timing, oh, bad timing. It's fine, I took care of it. I don't really want to be taking too much damage on this mission because it's a very minor one and I don't get paid much. Whoops. That took care of him. Okay, good. Alright, everything's fine. I'm coming for you. Yes, it feels very good. You may be looking at this and be like, does that feel good? It does. It feels fantastic, actually. Yeah, Archibus scored big money. Prizes. I don't know. I don't speak mercenary. Ah, <laughs> uh, whoops, 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 whoops. Outside of combat zone. You're right. Ah, oh, I'm back. <laughs> this doesn't seem very fair. <laughs> <laughs> Not complaining. <laughs> Off you go. Six, two, one. Wait. I'm picking up new enemy signatures. Yeah, and? Like yeah, it should be easy. What's even the problem? You're acting like it's a problem. Oh, wrecked. Oh. What? Why was there blooping? I don't like the blooping. That was scary. Ah.
Coming for you. Down you go. Down you go. Do a reload. Uh, I'm stuck behind this thing. That took care of him. Ah. Uh, I haven't gotten used to how long it takes for melee to fucking recharge. Doesn't need to know shit. I took a lot of damage, more than I needed to. All in a day's work, boss. I love piloting the mechs. I'm very good at it. Oh, God. I can feel the incompetence as I'm piloting it. it. It's still fun. Like, it's a great time, but... It's something where I'm doing it and I'm like, yeah, I've got a lot to learn on how to actually control this thing. And it's going to be different with every new fucking mech, I bet. This is a notification from All Mind, the mercenary support system. Hello, All Mind. Registration number RB23. Call sign Raven. Your return to mercenary activities has been acknowledged. Hooray! Restoring access to the parts shop. Yes! Now, aren't people going to ask questions like, Oh, Raven, isn't that guy dead? Why is he now active? Parts shop. Excise data added to training. What parts have you... Ooh. Purchase AC parts sold by the various corporations and factions from the buy menu. More parts will be available as you do stuff. Oh my god, it's a handgun. Oh my god, it's a fucking magnum. Large caliber handgun developed by Balaam, the rise of core theory introduced a new kind of close quarters combat and with it a reappraisal of handguns which demonstrates stopping power with tremendous impact potential. Oh god damn, fucking god damn, and the bazooka! Straight up, and that's a burst rifle, but oh my god that handgun, oh, oh I want it. Now you can have a gun in the other hand if you want- Oh, I, I could dual pistols! I could have a mech with dual pistols! Oh, I could. Oh, it's a thing I could do. Or dual machine guns. Oh, I think I'd rather keep my um, melee option, to be on honest, but damn. Standard pulse shield developed by Takigawa Harmonics. Generally unremarkable in terms of performance, but is a well-balanced for its low end footprint. It also offers a, initially, a relatively long initial guard duration for ease of use. I don't understand what a pulse shield does. Uh, it shields? I guess? Another missile launcher, if I was so inclined. A dual missile launcher. I could get a different head. Oh, that's a cool head. That's a cool head. I like the flat head, though. That's very fun. And these heads affect performance. Oh, I could get an entire... Oh, new cores! That core and that core, which is big chunky. And that, which is probably quite small. And that, which is a lot small. Get new arms. I need... Oh my god, these are all extra thi- Oh my god, oh, oh, oh god, oh, there's so many things! I need that- oh, I need that pistol, though. You don't understand, I need the pistol. It might actually be easier to do this with the fucking keypad than try and do it with the mouse. Ah, oh, I need that pistol. I know it's a bad idea. I don't care. Give me the pistol. Give me the pistol. Give me the pistol. I love pistols. So, right arm. HG003 Coquillet. Yes. Improve EN recharge. Significantly. It would just lower EN capacity a bit. Which is my ability to boost and shit. That seems like an extremely important investment. Because I run out of boost and stuff so quickly. I should probably learn combat fundamentals. That'd probably be a good thing for me to learn, all things considered, don't you think? Some weapons are capable of charge attacks, which exhibit different properties and behavior compared to regular attacks. Yeah, I'm familiar with charge attacks. Oh! Oh! I wasn't ready for that! Oh! Oh! <laughs> <laughs> Ooh, the ACS attitude control system of a craft can be compromised by accumulated strain from the impact of repeated attacks. ACS overload results in a vulnerable state called stagger, during which time the afflicted craft will be immobilized and susceptible to critical damage. So you want to stagger them and then hit them with the melee. Like when I was fighting the helicopter. 
Yeah, all attacks are treated as direct hits and deal much more damage. Okay, so... That did appear to do him in, yes. Wait for it, wait for it, wait for it. Yeah, that, that did appear to do it. Oh, that's quite cool, though. I missed. It's okay. I get two swings. It's fine. Shields equipped to the left shoulder can be deployed to reduce incoming ACS strain. In incoming damage and strain. I can't even read today. I'm too I'm too hyped. Ooh, that's pretty cool. I think I should get a pulse shield for my mech, because if I'm leaning towards pistols, which is a much more close combat option, I'm gonna want to deflect some damage on my way in. Shield output is maximized for one to two seconds after deployment. Blocking during this initial guard, it has a parry. Oh, I see. Let me try that again. Yeah. Okay, let's try again. I think I did that right. I don't know, probably. Uh, I did it, whatever. Sue me, you won't. No balls. Well, let's try a fucking mission, shall we? Actually, first, let's buy a shield. I probably shouldn't spend, like, all of my money, but... The game has convinced me that a pulse shield would probably be helpful. Yes, indeed. Lowers my boost speed ever so slightly, but shield. Ah, it's the other mission, the one I didn't do. Extra rewards based on number of enemies destroyed. I should go on a fucking rampage. I'm gonna go on a fucking rampage. I'm gonna do it. Got a job for you, 621. This is an open call from the Balaam Group, one of the corporate forces occupying Rubicon. Uh-huh. Attention all independent mercenaries! This request comes from our affiliate, Dothung. We just shot them. The Rubicon Liberation Front has deployed BIOS artillery throughout the contaminated city. The city itself has no strategic value. We cannot allow them to hinder expansion of the Coral Survey. Show us your ambition. Destroy the Liberation Front's artillery. So there's a Liberation Bonus Force? will be awarded for destroying their MTs. We want the enemy weakened. How much are you going to pay? Big money? Consider it an opportunity to prove yourself. Impress us, mercenaries! But there's a liberation force. Now, what's their what's their deal? You know, I'm so I'm too moral for a fucking uh, mercenary. But I want to know what that's all about. I want to lead a bit of revolution. I'm down for that. I got a mech. That's basically what they're for. Doesn't care who does this job. As long as it gets done. Oh, I'll get it done. Oh, you better believe I'll get it done. Finest mercenary you've ever seen. Except not really. Except actually kind of pathetic as far as mercenaries go because I suck at this game. But someday I might not suck at this game. Someday I might even be somewhat decent at this game. And then I'll show them and they'll pay me. And then I'll lose all my money because I got damaged during the battle. But fuck it. So. Pistol. Okay, I got it. I got it. Don't even worry. You just put the kettle on, bruv. I'll be home soon. Yes, I meleeed a helicopter. What do you got? No balls. The pistol is quite good, as it turns out. The pistol is quite strong. I'm already keen. I see a bitch over there. I'm coming for you. I press the wrong. I keep thinking that left click is the fucking gun, and it's not. Left click is the melee. Right click is the gun. Ow. All right. Yeah. The artillery. Yeah. Go about that. Good stuff, good stuff. I want to kind of leave it alive for a bit so I can kill people. Uh, not just for the purposes of killing people, but for money. I could do with money. There. 
over dog. Don't give him another inch. Cracked him. Fuck your artillery. I forgot I had missiles. That probably took care of him. That took care of him. Oh boy, oh boy, oh boy, oh boy, oh boy, oh boy, no. Oh, oh, there's a lot of targets around here. Oh. Oh, 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 it's... Oh, there's a lot around there. Oh, there's a lot around there. Are those all artillery installments? Because if so, I should go back and destroy that first one. I guess I underestimated how many there were. I thought there was going to be like two. Hey, buddy. Don't mind me. There we go. That's you taken care of. Yeah, it turns out there's more than one site. Who'd have thunk it? I can't believe they weren't paying me a hundred grand just to destroy one artillery site. It is hard to hit helicopters uh, with the pistol, I've noticed. There we go. Yes, 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 yes. I'll figure it out. Oh god, I've used too many bullets. I'm gonna have to use the buildings as cover if I want to get close. It's gonna be a little spooky if I'm out in the open when they fire. Ah. Oh. Good, 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 good. Excellent. Making it happen. I'm gonna stalk them. Oh, yes. Coming up on his flank. He's got nothing on me. Got you. Up. Ah, no. No. Why is this one so tough? Why, why, why? Oh, hello. Why is that one so strong? That one's really... What the fuck? Ah. Why is that one so strong? Please stop. The other ones went down like nothing. That one isn't going anywhere. Unless I need to get behind it. Oh, there we go. I guess I wasn't doing it properly? Question mark? Yeah, I'm using a lot of ammo. It is something of an issue. I think this is why you would always want a melee option, because you can't run out of ammo on a melee option, so you'll always have something to fight with. Whereas if you just went guns, you run the re very real risk of just running out of ammo and being screwed. I just want to pick these guys off. Got you! I don't think I get paid to kill them. They're the smaller ones, but it's fine. You, however, I do get paid to kill. Yeah, that shot got him. Yeah, that shot got him. Oh, God, there's another site. No one ever said there'd be another site. They're getting their money's worth out of me, I'll tell you what. Just charge them more. In fact, I will. I'll learn the range on those eventually. I should probably get on with that. I've taken quite a few shots. Don't tell them what to do when it leads to my death. Yeah, yeah, Liberation Front. Yeah, that's cute. Yeah, yeah. Well, you'll die as one as well, you know. You'll group together. It makes it easier to hit you with splash damage. Confirmed. All targets destroyed. 
I've done it. I've done it. Money! Wait, I need more money! I think I killed them all! That's not a lot of money I got for destroying MTs. I'm being shot at! Okay. Bonus pay. 78 grand. Actually, that's not bad. In fact, that makes up for everything I lost through damage and um, ammunition. So that was totally worth it. That was a big payday. Big success. I'm not used to having big success. It's usually mini success that's very pyrrhic because I lost too much in the process. One new message. It's reach you about your AC's extended warranty. Registration number RB23. Call sign Raven. Your records have been updated. You have also been granted access to participate in the Log Hunt program. Log Hunt? We kindly request that you submit combat logs after destroying designated craft. All Mind will reward you with parts based on the number of submissions you provide. Why? Discover and destroy targets marked with the Log Hunt target icon to obtain combat log for f logs for submission. Collect combat logs and improve your hunter class to receive reward parts from All Mind. That does sound pretty good. So can I replay missions and they would have those in there? Replay missions you have previously completed. You can review your rank for each mission from this menu. To achieve an S rank, you must complete the mission without retrying from a checkpoint while also minimizing incoming damage, time taken, and ammunition consumed. Okay. Can I have a new melee weapon? I want to see what melee weapons you got. The pulse blade is very cool, but I'm sure you've got something else in the back, right? Ah, oh, come on. No melee weapons yet? None? It's a bit of a downer, you know. Need more melee options. Ah, two new missions. Destroy transport helicopters. Extra reward based on number of enemies destroyed, or Darfeng Core Industries test a an AC fight. Ooh. If I'm gonna fight an AC, another AC, I should do as much prep as possible. So. Pistol's good. Uh, my complaint probably is that it doesn't have enough ammo. I would love to dual wield pistol. I would love to dual wield pistols. I really would. It would lower my weight significantly. But at what cost? Get a booster. And I think the booster is all I can afford right now. Or I could get my flat head that I love. It would make me significantly lighter. But not much less. Yeah, fuck it. I want my flat head. Yeah, I'm going to get my flat head. It makes me way lighter for not much less durability. It seems like a win-win. Okay, yeah, I just looked at the stats on the left. Uh, hmm. Fuck it. Fuck it. I want my flathead. My flathead screwdriver, that's what I'm calling my mech. Alright, let's fight an AC. Time for a mano a mano fight. Mech versus mech. Got a job for you, 621. It's an open call from the Archibus group. To all independent mercenaries, this request comes from Schneider of the Archivist. Hey, it's Schneider again. What do you want? Dafung, one of our adversaries allied with Balaam, has introduced a new tester AC. Surely we'll get parts for this. It's a sample model from an external architect, featuring extensive assembly optimizations. In the hands of an experienced pilot, it will pose a threat far too great to ignore. This brings me to the request. Intercept delivery of the tester AC and destroy it. Can I, can I salvage it? The Archivist group looks forward to news of your success. I want AC parts more than anything Bring else. And happy hunting. Send me free parts. Sponsor me. I'm an influencer, you know. <laughs> if you send me free AC parts, I'll promote you or something. I don't know how that shit works, really. I'm also not an influencer. I'm a guy on YouTube who plays video games. The target may be a, product a distinction with a difference. AC. Stay sharp, six, two, I'm gonna fuck him up. Time to go punch your face. We've got a read on the target. Now's the time, 621. Nothing in my immediate surroundings. Okay, let's go. Ah, oh, I'm gonna have to say, I'm already quite enthralled with this game. I like it a lot. I've never played a properly good action mech game. Well, I've played some that were pretty good, but nothing like this.
I fucked up. I fucked up. I fu I could have had him. I could have had him in that moment. I fucked up. Oh my god, he locked me up. Ah. Uh. Oh my god, he did it to me too. You're not. Ah, uh, he actually is keeping up with a real merc. Okay, it's fine, it's fine. I've had to use way too many fucking repair kits, but it's fine. Yes, you can. You can and you will. Oh my god. Alright, it's fine, it's fine. You knocked out your fucking lock pretty quick, didn't you? Jeez. No repair kit remaining. Hey man, I gotta eat somehow, you know. It's time we wrap this up. Gotcha. I just, You're just too shit. I just wanted a call sign of you should have stole one like I did, idiot. Get wrecked. Uh, <laughs> what a loser. <laughs> Seriously, if you want a license, just go fucking get one. God damn. <laughs> you don't need to learn how to pilot a mech, just steal one. I didn't make that much money from this, honestly. Uh, I did kind of get beat up quite a bit. And from what I can tell, from what I saw in, um, from, uh, For Answer, I think the, uh, expenses in this game are a lot more lenient than they are in the older games. Like, I don't, I think, I feel like I should be getting charged a lot more than I actually am for the amount of damage I'm taking and stuff like that. Not fucking complaining for a second, kind of glad, but I'm pretty sure they used to be a lot harsher. I can only speak so much about For Answer because I never played it, I only saw Two Best Friends Play play it, or Super Best Friends Play. It looks really cool. 621. About the tester AC. Yeah, did. I fucked him up, didn't I? That was being shipped to the Red Guns. Balaam's in-house AC squad. They're Balaam's main force, and its members are no amateurs. Remember who you're messing with. I'm a mercenary, nothing's personal, come on. Do it for money. If they want me to fight for them, they should offer me some money. And I'll fight for them instead. That's how this works. I know it's a bad idea. But I, I want to try it out. I want to try out dual pistols. Just for one mission. I just want to try out dual pistols. Because it's the hype thing to do. It's the hype thing to do. You can't tell me that dual pistols isn't hype. It just is. I won't- I, I'm not accepting disputing opinions on this matter. I'm just not. I'm sorry. You can comment, and you can say that you don't think it's the hypest shit. I will just ignore you. Because it's the hypest shit. Got a job for you, it's just probably not very effective. The Balaam group sent a request. Raven, this request comes from Dafa, one of our affiliates. Yeah, Dafang need the help. committed to use of military force to handle the Rubicon Liberation Front. Target for this mission is a squad of transport choppers. Destroy them. I'm on it. You'll encounter guerrilla resistance from Baos mass produced MTs. They're no great concern. They sure aren't. You performed adequately in your last sortie, Raven. This did not go on. I cleared to that fucking combat site, sir. We will be watching with interest to see what you bring to the team. I bring a mech and two pistols. I won't I don't I wouldn't use two pistols or lean into the idea of using two handguns for the rest of the playthrough because I love having melee options. I really fucking do. I just wanted to try it out. I just want to see what it's like. To wield that kind of power. For you by name. Yeah. They know who I am. Keep building your rep. This game is fucking sick. I'm I'm having an absolute blast already. Activating combat mode. Commence mission. 
Also, ladies and gentlemen, it just occurred to me to ask. I literally just thought of it just this second, but I'm planning on um, doing a video where I'm going to customize my mech and I want to go deep into like doing colors and maybe sorting out decals and emblems and stuff. And I imagine the video is probably going to take like half an hour or so, maybe longer, hard to say. But I'm going to I'm going to be chatting during it, right? We're just going to talk about stuff and hang out, whatever. If that sounds interesting to you, great. I hope you're looking forward to it and I hope you like it. But what I wanted to do as well. If you have any questions that you'd like me to answer during that video, post them in the comments here or ping me on the Discord. There'll be a link to the Discord in the description or in the comment section for this video. If you've got questions for me, if there's stuff you want to hear about or just generally heard discussed, then uh, post them and we'll have a little hangout sesh while I customize our mech. See what we can make out of it. I think that could be fun. I don't know. It's up to you. You don't have to do nothing. You can just uh, lurk and enjoy the videos. It's fine by me. But I thought I'd throw out the, the suggestion, the offer. It's pretty cool having dual pistols. Oh my god, it actually feels really good. Because you alternate fire between them. Oh yeah! Oh. <laughs> oh, oh, if you if you combine this build with like high speed. Um, you would be- you- you could do so much. You could do so much. Now, it's not quite as up close and personal as I would like from like a- uh, from mech combat, because I do love me some melee. But it is definitely effective. Until you run out of ammo. Yeah. Corporation. Damn corporations. Target destroyed. On to the next targets. Oh yeah. And because it's like a single shot gun, you can kind of count how many bullets it takes to kill something. Yeah, unfortunately, if you miss a bullet, it's really bad. Like, that's a significant amount of your ammo that's gone. But, you know. Oh, it's... I like it. I like it a lot. And the ability, the fact that I can do this if I want to, I can have a dual uh, Akimbo's pistol mech. Is that the best idea? No, probably not. But you can. Fight back. Fight back. You won't. No, for an AP. no balls. I don't think so. Oh my god, alright, alright buddy, sell down. Okay, it's actually- oh, quite tough. This is a bad idea. Yeah, that got me. Okay, yeah, ignore that thing. Can I change my loadout by any chance? I love dual pistols, but uh, yeah, I can go into assembly. Brilliant. All right, I love dual pistols, right? It's fantastic. I actually really enjoy doing that, but having a melee option, especially against something like that, being able to just smash it really hard would be valuable. The melee, having the melee option is actually quite important, but 
That was cool. That was fun. I stopped fucking talking during that because I was enjoying the fight. That was great. I loved it. Loved every second, even though I lost. It was just fun. Let's do this! I love giant robots! Come over here, you fuck! Ah, oh, you clever dickens. Yeah, clever little ducky. Off you go. Confirmed. Transport chopper down. Keep at it, 621. Oh, I've got it. Don't even worry about it, buddy. I know exactly what I'm doing. It's all part of the big plan. I mentioned that I'm having a great time because <laughs> I am. I still want to see if I can destroy that big robot. I want to see if I can beat it. Probably not, but I'd like to try. Someone else is shooting at me. Came from over there. I saw it. I seen it. You can't tell me I didn't see it. Oh, there is a little radar on the bottom that actually shows you where hostiles are. Oh, that's very helpful. I should use that to inform my future movements. Gotcha. Oh my god, oh my god, oh my god. Oh, mechs. Oh, giant robots. It's here, it's now, it's live, it's good, you love it. It's the season of robots here on the show. We've got the robots in Frostpunk, none at the moment because the refugee scenario doesn't really have any in there. And this, and that's all the robots. Okay, so there aren't that many, but there's still some. And that's pretty cool. Well, if I'm going to engage that thing, I need to be ready. So, reload. I'm doing all right. And let's go in. Yowch. Okay, bad start. It's fine, it's fine, it's fine. Making it happen, making it happen. Ooh, that was bad! Youch! Gotcha! Oh! That's uh, me, it's Raven. I'm that guy, you know. Uh, it only took me two tries. <laughs> I just needed a warm up, you know. Uh, I got there in the end. Uh, it's no big deal. No big deal. That probably cost me a lot of money in terms of repairs. This, ge this game is great. This game is great. This game is fucking brilliant. This game's fucking brilliant. This game's fucking brilliant. This game's fucking brilliant. Looks like you got them all. I sure fucking did. I got them all. Job, all. Return to base. 
most, not just some, not just a couple, not just most. All. All of them. Oh, this is so good. What's the kind of game where they're like, hey, there's extra fucking targets on the combat site, and you're like, good, good, more, more, and we'll pay you for it as well, and you're like, yes, more. So repair costs were pretty high, but like, with everything involved, and considering that destroying that quadruped or whatever the fuck it was, yeah, got us a log hunt thing. Totally worth it, 100%. Absolutely. I hope there's a lot more side missions, like, for just, you know, making money and stuff, instead of all being story missions. As it were. Well, 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 Handler Walter. The way your hound's been up in my business, I'm surprised you'd even dare to call. Michigan, about my proposal. I bet this will go well. Yeah, you sure about that? I'll be working your hound just as hard as any other red gun. Gen 4s can be emotionally withdrawn. They need a shot in the arm every now and then. Then you got a deal. I'll send Volta to Guasu. Uh-huh. They'll give your latest hound a proper red gun welcome. Uh-huh. What the deal? You gonna tell me what the fuck that's about? Or are you just gonna let me find out for myself? It's a real boots on the ground kind of job. They just throw you in. Gotta eat somehow. Interesting. So what do we got next? I mean, it'll probably be the... Uh, oh, no, there's different missions. Interesting. Okay. But that is all I've got time for today, ladies and gentlemen. I would happily sit here and play this for another God knows how long. I've been playing for an hour and 45 minutes. I could go for a lot longer, but... We should keep this reasonably length, and this is not going to be everyone's cup of tea, so I don't want to immediately shove an ungodly amount of mech gameplay into you guys' faces. Thank you so much for watching. Let me know what you think about the idea to customize the mech whilst talking about stuff. If you've got any questions, then feel free to post them in the comments or send them to me on Discord, and then I can talk about those during the video. That'd be a lot of fun. It'd be a nice, relaxed little thing we can do. Um... I would like to do more of this, I would. I'm really enjoying it, but I'll definitely be looking at the the statistics for the video because I'm doing a lot at the moment. I've got a lot of ongoing things in terms of videos and stuff at the moment. So in order to justify continuing something, I, I gotta see some results from it. And if this doesn't get some results, then I'll just continue playing the game in my own time because I'm having a blast of it. Although I do still need to finish Baldur's Gate 3 in my own time, so I'm going through that as well. I've got plenty to play. But... Let me know what you think. Let me know if you want to see it. I'll be looking at, um, you know, views and likes and comments and stuff to see if I should continue recording this or if I should just leave it at this with my one time of fun with it on the channel and then just play it in my off time. But none of that is really your responsibility or concern or anything like that. I just want to let you know what I'm doing. Ladies and gentlemen, thank you so much for watching. This has been an absolute blast. Special thanks to Linky, Zeon Cedar, Bimblewart, Tum King, Majoko Maiman, Adarsh Sanjeev, Alkir, Honeydew Corporation, Sweet Baby Red, MB Alias, Lord Skullington, Jessica Kissy, Plutonium Pie, Dreamer Ghost, Lepa Lullaby, K Bub, Magic Howl, The Frostbite, Monsoon, Sir World, Warmaster Oku, SCP 106A, Nomad, and Kenny T800 for supporting me on Patreon. Thank you so much, guys, and thank you all so much for watching. This has been a blast. Uh, I wasn't sure what to expect going into it. I knew Armored Core was good, but, you know, like. I didn't know if the new one was going to be good, and like I wasn't sure how much I'd get into it when playing it, as it were, but I'm having a blast so far. I'm having an absolute blast. I love, I've always loved the idea of being, of playing the career of a mech pilot, as it were, and while I do get a bit of a feel of that from Battle Mech, being able to actually manually control it, have it be an action game rather than a strategy game, provides a different kind of enjoyment, right? Like, if, if, if I had played this before Battle Mech, I'd be sat here lamenting the fact that I wasn't playing a, a strategy mech game, and then I'd go play Battle Mech. But having both in my Steam library means I get all the mech gameplay that I could want, and that makes me very happy. But I'm rambling. Truly, none of this matters. Thank you so much for watching. Let me know if you want to see more of this and whatever happens next time, and it could be more of this. But at the very least, I do want to do a video on, um, on painting the mech and, uh, you know, customizing it and hanging out and having that be a chill, relaxed thing. So, I hope... You want to see that? If you do, then good news for you, but whatever happens next time...
I hope I see you there. Turtles, goodbye.